Our third match of the day, Papua New Guinea, the Orchids to face the Ravens of Canada. The Ravens 10 metre line. Go five. Ah, Jose linking up. Support everywhere. They must score surely. And they do. The player in Jersey 14, Christy Bulhage. Canada, six metres out from the line. They come the short side. Natasha Smith having a big crack. She may have it on the line, I'm not sure. Rage, Ontario, the home. And look at that. Straight as an arrow from wide out. The Ravens hit the front. Keller. Hold, Natasha hold. Smith will have a crack from acting half the original try scorer. She's got another one. Got Natasha Smith, definitely no doubt about that one. Warming in. Tackle five. They're five metres out, PNG. And a big chance for them. And on the outside, it comes to Martha Cole. And PNG are going to get another try. His defence was sliding. And now PNG carting the ball back to the middle. A powerful run by Joan Kuman. That's the fifth and last. We've got a player injured on the ground in back play who looks to be in a fairly bad way. I've got to say there was some heavy contact. Two support players on a right. Probably smart not to go with them. They're running out of territory with the sideline looming. And Snore, a little grabbing kick in behind them. Oh, it's going to come up. Trumps. I think it's McDade that's grabbed it. McDade for Canada. But also in the mix was Helen Abau. Open side they go. Schnorr to McDade. And now to Petrinos. They've got an overlap. It comes to Natasha Smith. They won't stop Natasha. Not from close range. And she gets another World Cup try. And Canada gets its first rugby league World Cup victory in history. Big win over Papua New Guinea.